Russia recently received an additional batch of Su-34 fighter jets to bolster its military operations in Ukraine. The announcement, made earlier this week by the state-owned United Aircraft Corporation, confirmed that these latest Su-34 jets have passed all required ground and flight tests prior to their transfer to the Russian Ministry of Defense. This shipment is part of the annual production plan following earlier deliveries in April and June. Moscow has reportedly deployed these advanced Su-34 fighter bombers to the front lines in Ukraine to support its aerospace forces. The Su-34, known by its NATO reporting name Fullback, is a twin-engine long-range strike aircraft designed for strategic bombing missions. It is capable of carrying a variety of guided and unguided missiles and bombs, as well as a 30mm cannon. With a range of approximately 2,000 miles and a maximum speed of 1,180 miles per hour, the Su-34 can operate effectively both day and night. Vladimir Artyakov, first deputy general director of Rostec, announced in a press statement that the recently delivered Su-34s exhibit exceptional flight performance and are highly effective in engaging enemy targets. These aircraft are in high demand within the armed forces, primarily due to their ability to utilize high-precision munitions with a universal planning and correction module that has proven its effectiveness in air defense zones. The aircraft is intended for long-range strikes, but has recently been used in closer-range operations, leading to losses due to Ukraine's air defense systems. Russia had approximately 100 Su-35 fighter jets, over 100 Su-34 fighter bombers, and seven A-50 airborne early warning aircraft before the invasion. Since the conflict began in February 2022, the Russian Air Force has reportedly lost an estimated 30 aircraft. Despite facing losses, Russia continues producing Su-34s to replace those lost reaffirming its commitment to boosting combat capabilities in the ongoing conflict. Stay informed and subscribe to our channel for the latest breaking news on military affairs. Thank you for watching.